It's Dr. Trish Lee. Let's talk about how neurofeedback brain training can be a super important part of recovery from a porn habit. Okay, so this is how neurofeedback helps. Neurofeedback will shift your brain performance pattern out of the one that is creating the lack of willpower and the draw towards your habit. It is a weakened brain pattern that leads towards addiction. So your brain will be shifted out of that pattern into the calm focus mode that has more willpower, that wants to get up and go in the world and doesn't want to escape into fantasy. So this is how it happens. If a brain is running in an anxious and overwhelmed mode, it's less easy for that brain or that person to engage in the real world. This is the pattern that leads to addiction. So this extra fast brain speed, high beta, is at the root of anxiety and anxiousness and stress. If your brain's using too much of that, it's likely that you will need to escape your reality. At the same time, extra slow brain speed, delta, is uh, the culprit in fatigue and overwhelm and burnout. So if a brain is using both of them, it's stressed out and it's burnt out and exhausted. That brain can't handle engaging in the world. It just wants to escape into an unreality. So what neurofeedback does is it trains these two extremes down and trains up alpha and low beta perfect processing speed in the middle. So now you can engage in your world and be more successful. Usually, having behavioral reboot is just as important and we have to do both of these things so that we can rewire the brain and then reboot the behavior so that now both of them are working really well simultaneously so that person or you can go out into the world and just be happy and healthy and whole. Okay, so I hope that helps you understand how neurofeedback can really be a really important part in recovery for someone who's struggling with a pornography habit. For the partner, neurofeedback is essential because what happens there is that person is struggling with trauma, usually with betrayal, and many times, and science shows this, that a partner's brain will go into a depressed or an anxious mode, or both of them, and depression is very common when a woman or a partner finds out. So that depressed brain is in a very dysregulated mode and also needs to be brought back. And that's how neurofeedback can help both partners in a coupleship when there is a pornography habit involved. Okay, so I hope this helps you out. And remember, control your brain or it'll control you.